I got this bucket of tools at a yard sale for five dollars. Not a bad haul, right? The most interesting item in the bucket was this reversible saw. It looks like one side is for trimming branches and one side is for cutting lumber. The blade could stand to be a little straighter. You loosen this wing nut and pull the blade out to reverse it. Seems like a good way to cut up your hand. First I checked the temper of the blade by bending it in both directions. It seemed like one section was not springing back. It didn't look like the blade saw any heat, so it may not be the best quality steel or heat treat. I can usually get saw blades straight with some cold working. Watch your fingers. I managed to get it pretty straight. First I scraped off the worst rust with a razor blade. I used a wire wheel to clean the teeth. You can only do this in one direction. If you go the wrong way, the wire wheel tries to throw the blade. Ask me how I know. I sanded the saw blade down to 400 grit. Not too bad. I am not a pro at sharpening saw blades. There are plenty of good how-to videos out there, but I was able to get the blade sharper than it was. The original finish on the handle was in pretty good shape, so I cleaned it with mineral spirits and went over it with superfine steel wool. I was careful not to damage the wood finish when I cleaned up the medallion and the pin. I cleaned up the wing nut and screw and waxed the handle and blade. Here's the saw in action using the conventional crosscut blade. Now I'll reverse the blade while taking care not to draw blood. And here's the saw in action using the tree trimming blade. Here's some photos of the saw. I couldn't find any information about the manufacturer online. Please leave a comment if you have any information on Dorby, Germany. I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching.